looked like dropping molten slag out behind it. Like it was kind of glowing and it was like trailing out behind it and hitting the ground. Huh. Uh, more than one occasion. No noise. Fairly close, within a mile or so. You think, you know, you'd hear something making that kind of a, an image or, a, you know, that kind of thing going on. You'd hear something. So he backtracked where it was, went and found this stuff, and he actually found physical stuff on the ground. And he's had all kinds of people look at it, and they have no clue so, or, um, what in the world. Sci-fi junkies, metal, when metal, reality, glass, you know, there's just critical metal, proof. I mean, there's, you know, hard evidence in so many of these situations. It's just that everyone is so afraid to um, stand on their own research and really kind of speak up and explain more wholeheartedly on it. And that if maybe something like that did occur, and, um, there might be a so deeper sense of, get that uh, of the connectivity I was talking through. about. I don't know how long. I think like a decade they did. Um, they cognitively let me do some of this memory. After that, they did the Brookings report, and they said, you know what, we got all this um, information, and pretty much you guys can't handle it. You'd all freak out. And they kind of, they did put a little bit of a blame. They planet trying to take over that kind of thing. They eat humans. Uh, there have been uh, accounts of people being on UFOs, and not only uh, coming in contact with fake aliens, as in uh, they've been drugged and brought onto the ship. There's a military presence. Uh, they become aware of... And so the alien crafts started arriving, and in 1947, one fucked up and crashed outside of Roswell as it was going towards where the atomic bomb was first set off on Earth. The first major thing happened. Um, and so they came here, they crashed, we know what happened. We watched on Discovery Channel. But then after that, several other things happened. There were, there were sightings, like serious sightings. Uh, and the way that the guy made it stop was calling out the name of Jesus Christ. So, like that. That's interesting. Not only now, but really back, back, back in you know, 47, very rare, and probably, yeah, used around the military. Uh, that's where I came into contact with that, that type of thing. Would, so um, what, what blind arrogance that we would.